The Struggle to Stay, Why Single Evangelical Women Are Leaving the Church, by Katie Gadini is a thought-provoking exploration of the challenges faced by single evangelical women within the context of the church. Through insightful analysis and personal narratives, Gadini delves into the complex intersection of faith, gender, and societal expectations that often lead these women to disengage from their religious communities. Gadini begins by establishing the significance of her subject matter, acknowledging the vital role that single women have played in evangelical churches historically. She emphasizes that these women have been instrumental in church growth, often filling various leadership roles, yet their experiences and concerns are frequently marginalized or ignored. By framing her argument in this way, Gadini immediately captures the reader's attention and underscores the urgency of the issue. One of the central themes in Gadini's essay is the tension between traditional gender roles and the aspirations of single evangelical women. She elucidates how many churches maintain a patriarchal structure that can be particularly confining for single women. They often face pressure to conform to prescribed gender roles, which can limit their opportunities for leadership and personal fulfillment. Gadini illustrates this point with compelling anecdotes from single women who have experienced this restriction firsthand, effectively humanizing her argument. Furthermore, Gadini delves into the challenge of finding a suitable partner within the church, a struggle that many single evangelical women encounter. She explains how the emphasis on marriage and family life within evangelical communities can create a sense of inadequacy among single individuals. This societal expectation, combined with the pressure to marry within the faith, can be emotionally and spiritually taxing. Gadini successfully connects this emotional burden to the disillusionment that leads some women to leave the church altogether. In her essay, Gadini also addresses the isolation that single evangelical women often experience within their church communities. She highlights the lack of support systems tailored to their unique needs and the discomfort they may feel when their marital status becomes the focus of conversations. This isolation can lead to feelings of invisibility and disconnect, which Gadini argues can be a significant factor in the decision to disengage from the church. Gadini employs effective rhetorical strategies throughout her essay to bolster her arguments. She integrates relevant statistics and research to support her claims, adding credibility to her narrative. For instance, she cites surveys that reveal the significant decline in church attendance among single adults, particularly women, over the past few decades. These statistics substantiate her central thesis that single evangelical women are leaving the church. Additionally, Gadini's use of personal narratives adds a compelling layer of authenticity to her essay. By including the voices and experiences of single evangelical women, she humanizes the issues at hand, making them relatable to a broader audience. Readers are more likely to empathize with and understand the struggles of these women through the first-hand accounts she provides. Gadini concludes her essay with a call to action for the evangelical church. She argues that in order to retain and support single women within the faith community, churches must embrace inclusivity, challenge traditional gender norms, and create spaces where these women feel valued and heard. She urges the church to recognize that the exodus of single evangelical women represents a loss not only for these individuals but for the church itself. In The Struggle to Stay, Katie Gadini effectively explores the complex factors that drive single evangelical women away from the church. Her essay combines rigorous analysis with personal narratives, creating a compelling argument that highlights the urgency of addressing these issues within the evangelical community. Gadini's call to action resonates, emphasizing the importance of inclusivity in empathy in retaining and supporting all members of the church, 
regardless of their marital status. Through her thoughtful and insightful writing, she contributes to a broader conversation about the evolving role of women within religious institutions and the necessity of adapting to their changing needs and aspirations.